Alright, as you can tell by uh, the video's name, we are going to be downloading a YouTube song from YouTube and convert it into an MP3 um, and automatically sync it into your iTunes and save it into a, a folder or whatever. Um, <clears throat> so what you're going to need is, uh, is obviously like iTunes. That's optional because if you don't use iTunes, that's that's fine. You can just save your music into a, a folder. So uh, if you want, you can get iTunes. This this next one is what you're gonna need. It's called Media Human to YouTube to MP3. The original site is called MediaHuman.com. I'll put the link to the description. And uh, this is the download right here. And when you open it up, if I can just do this, it's gonna look ex almost exactly like that. I I have mine shaped like that for some reason. Um, this is what it's gonna look like um, after you've installed it. Um, so first, first thing you're gonna do is find your song or whatever. Right now I'm into like rock music, so or punk rock, whatever it's called. So I'm just gonna do like Ghost Town. <clears throat> Monster. Okay, this one I don't have. Alright, whatever. Okay, so this is what you're going to need. And the URL, which is up here, you copy that with Control C, go to your uh, Media Human YouTube to MP3, and paste it. What you're going to have is these titles, artist, album, whatever. And this is going to be the tags that you're going to be uh, assigning to the file. Doesn't mean the file is going <clears> to <throat> look like this. So the title is basically the song title. Um, this is called Monster. Go to Artist, um, Ghost Town. <clears throat> and if you want it to sync to your iTunes, there's a button right here with the, uh, the note, the musical note. <clears throat> Sorry, I have... <clears throat> I'm kind of sick. Um, if you want to add more preferences, you can go here to the cog, press preferences, um, and it's obviously going to open your iTunes if you want it to sync. Um, so everything here should be untouched except for the audio output because uh, these, these are the things that you'd want to do yourself. The audio output, if you want um, to put your songs into a folder, you can just like, I don't know, make a, make a folder here, um, press choose, go to wherever you made your folder, and then that's where your songs are going to be saved. Um, file name template. You're gonna you're gonna want to keep that as title. Um, convert to MP3. Keep that. Keep that. This is the iTunes part. Um, add to iTunes. The playlist. You can you can make a playlist here by like if you don't have your playlist in the list here, you can just make it up by I don't know just typing it, and it's going to make it up in iTunes. Right now, this is a rock punk kind of thing, so I'm going to put it in the rock slash punk playlist. Um, I don't think you want to delete the downloaded file, because you're going to want to keep the uh, the song right after. Um, everything should be fine after all of this. Uh, press apply, OK, and once you've done all the, um, the settings and stuff, you just press this down button thingy and it's going to download your song for you. And what's that going to what that's going to do is it's going to add into your music library and for whatever playlist you put it into. I put it into the pop slash rock part um it's going to save in here also. So you don't have to do all that uh, editing tags and stuff, or you're not you don't you're not gonna have, you know, the file name on your iPod or your iPhone instead of the song name. 
when you, when the song is playing, um, it's it's going to have the actual. It's just only going to have the actual song name, not just the file name. So it it doesn't look that bad onto your uh, on your currently playing, and uh, it's easier. It's easier to look for look for songs when you're doing it like this cuz uh you can find your song name and just just play it from there. You don't have to find the uh the file name instead. So uh that's that. This is my background. <laughs> um So yeah, that's that's basically it. Thank you.